was oh yeah that is no bueno We made it to the hotel. I'm actually feeling a lot better than earlier. Tomorrow we're gonna go up, I think Nolan Creek. We had some fish follow our glide baits this morning. <laughs> Is yours? <laughs> what the heck? Not mine. <laughs> Pay it forward. <laughs> All right. Literally just found a dollar hanging out of the vending machine. Um, so anyway, we are starting up in Nolan Creek tomorrow morning. We planned on putting it up there. Jeez, I don't know why I put it in there. Can't give me change back. All right, I get that. I need to... How far do I need to go? So we're up in that creek I was talking to you guys about. The water actually seems to have warmed up about a degree. Um, okay. Is that good? Yeah, we brought it up, yeah. Okay. We've got these two big boulders. I would say this is the deepest pool within a quarter mile, half mile on this creek. Yeah, I would say so too. And uh, what's going on here is we had, you know, like water temps in the mid 50s, even in some areas, lower 60s. And we've come to notice the past couple of weeks, way back in these creeks, like almost as far as we can get, we've been seeing fish. There was even one creek where we had fish. See, look, there's a turkey. Up in the tree? Yeah, I see him. Wow. Yeah, guys, we, we came in here this morning. You'll probably, they'll probably do it again here soon, but like, 15 to 20 turkeys just start calling out of nowhere and super pretty stuff. I mean, this is probably one of the prettiest creeks I've been in in a while. Anyway, we actually went back into this one creek and it got so warm that these fish were actually showing spawning activity and they weren't on beds or anything, but they were eating in front of us. And this water, although this water is clear, it was clearer than this. And we had them coming up and eating wacky rigs like right in front of us. I could actually play a clip of that. They all went back under. <laughs> yeah. Alright, he's gonna turn around and look at it. Try and eat it. <laughs> that is crazy. They get like they get like aggressive. Like you should have seen them, dude. One one was this is probably 14, maybe close. There was one coming out super slow. Another one started shooting out after it. Like they were both looking at the same bait. And so this guy just ate it. Like he got mad. There you go. What the heck? A fish on video on a day like this? So what's happened is this water has dropped down about, man, at least within the past couple weeks, 10 degrees, you know, maybe even 12 degrees. And um, these fish probably are coming out. What we're thinking is the fish are coming out of the back of this creek and kind of holding up on these deeper pools around these rocks. And if the sun comes out or it gets a little warmer, they can get up on these rocks and then once they all make up their mind, they can start going back up. So the other day we pre-fished just for a little bit. I was really sick and we had to kind of get off the water. I was throwing around a glide bait to try to get them to show themselves. And I had two little decent ones, keepers, following it. And then I took the bait out of the water and you can see this big old four or five pound female just cruising around after I had pulled the bait out of the water, you know, attracted to my bait. That's all we had to go off of from yesterday. So that's why we're starting here. And uh, hopefully we can get one of them to bite. We'll catch you guys later. All right, guys, what you missed? Caught one on the drop shot, right off one of those rocks. 
she's over 14, so let's keep her number one, fatty. All right, so white, white is small, okay? Oh, you oh yeah, sure. Are you relieved? Yes. Huh? Just one. I know, that's all we need. <laughs> all right, now we can uh, keep doing the drop shot. That was cool. And that was one of those little nails. So there should be more there. And it's funny, we've been we've been moving around, driving our boat around over there, and they don't even know. Calm down. Oh. That was a rock. So we gotta, we gotta just, just let it rain on the spot, dude. I mean, we gotta like, fish every inch, every little spot. We're gonna make it rain over here? Should make it, we should make rain with, rain with all our baits. So, I mean, I don't know if I had to explain it that thoroughly, but. <laughs> I didn't get what you Okay, wait, check it, check it. Is it filling? Look. Oh, look at the other one. We're recirculating. Okay, cool. All right, I'm gonna try the, because if there's fish down there, you know, we've been fishing here for a freaking minute. If there's fish down there, then. It's all about the light you can do. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna chuck out this glide bait and see if I can get one to come up. I think I like the other one better than this. That one's too slow than that. This one, this one you can't twitch. Left and right. You can't twitch it good. Well, that's what it says on the package. Yeah. To go like this. Oh, I see. Pretty. Yeah. Got him, got him, get the net, get the net, get the net. It's a good one. Oh, well, there's two with him. Jeez. Ooh. Oh yeah. Six cents full of glider, baby. Yes. Yes. I was like, am I hitting a rock? Oh. Let me just make sure. I can't believe I'm having to make sure with the freaking like what? See, so so they won't they won't eat Wow, that's barely 14. That's crazy. No, it's barely 14. It's just over 14. Yeah, I told you. It's, it's a good day. Yeah, we're, we're good. Chilling. Number two, guys. Well, that would tell me immediately to throw the jerkbait, but they're not eating it. If they see this, they're going to eat the jerkbait. We need to catch a big one. We just need to catch some. Okay. He's over there in that hole, right? After we... Okay, after I trim this down, let's start... Me and you both start being quiet because the farther we get back here, it's going to get shallower and there's fish around, you know. I just got hit again. Huh? There was one with him. Oh, biggin, 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 biggin. Got it, got him. Oh, baby, get the net, get the net, get the net. Get it, get it, get it, get it. It's right here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the GoPro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at that fish. <laughs> Look at what's going on. <laughs> Alright, we gotta relax. We gotta relax. Oh my gosh. I think this is the dude I saw the other day. So we've caught all three that we saw? Um, <laughs> that basically. <laughs> we caught all three of the fish that we saw. I thought she was coming off. Like the way it freaked out, I freaked out and I shouldn't have done that. Hey, hey, it's all right. As soon as, he went, as soon as it got involved in the A-Rig, then I had to stick my net in and grab it. Yeah. Alright guys, it's kind of a tangled mess here, but I'm going to try to show you what's going on. This is a new Six Cents Flow Glider 130. Just purchased yesterday. And that's a four pounder, right there. Watched him eat it like right at the boat. Man, I wish right you guys could have saw that. Oh man. Woo! 
Let's go. All right, yellow is big. All right. This is awesome. That is awesome. Hey, am I? Uh, am I allowed to say this is my idea? Oh. <laughs> Again, there's the new flow glider just we got yesterday. Um, first time ever throwing it. I kind of like it. I'm almost out of battery. I didn't charge the other one, and I only have the GoPro, the three left. I know we're probably top ten right now. We've got three. All right. Um, with these fish coming up and hitting the glide baits like this, I'm gonna throw the chest mount on. Just see how that goes. All right. Look at this mess. After we, I said, look at this mess. I think because the way that water warmed up the hair, they kind of it kind of has them going. We'll have a signal back there. Yeah, that was my fault with the whole um, the umbrella rig because I had it I had the umbrella rig hanging over the side of the boat. I know, jeez. Yeah. We're going to keep cruising down them, like as slow as we were. Billy, I don't know why they're not eating the freaking jerkbait. Because they're freaking destroying this thing. Like maybe they, they just moved back a step. Or moved up a step because it got a warm. It got warmer, like by a degree. It's definitely setting up like we could catch a giant. Yeah, because that's what's happening. Like I'm predicting that most of these guys will catch their fish early. Oh, there's one on it, big and big and big and big and big and big and. Please eat it. Oh, he turned away. He's right there. He's right here. Oh, he wants to eat it, but he sees the boat. He sees the boat. Oh my gosh, that's another one the same size. Same size. Mm. Oh my gosh, he's coming back for it. Do you see him? Big in, dude. Four pounder. Four pounder. Four pounder. Okay, what we need to do is get a Senko tied on. That's a giant. Okay. He's he's somewhere cruising in this big circle. He's, he didn't dart off. He saw us, but he didn't he didn't get startled enough to not follow it again. So he will eat. Since they're not gonna eat the jerk bait. Actually, let me try it. Let me see if they can get get him to eat this. Cause that was that was bigger than that. That was bigger than that. As my GoPro just died. I just caught a freaking giant on the glide bed. I switched up the glide bed because it wasn't swimming right. But oh my gosh, freaking toad. That's a five pounder all day. That's a five pounder all day. That was probably a... Um, what's winning right now I think is 14 pounds. We got around 13 or so. Yeah, so skinny and shallow. All right, you want to turn on like the manual? You fill it up? Yeah. You're going to catch it? Thanks. Yeah. This will kind of fill it up. So. Yeah. Yeah. You would have loved those today. 